Thick as a Brick, Jethro Tull. This is by far my favourite Tull album and is possibly my favourite prog rock album. It is fair to say that unlike most prog, this does not take itself very seriously. It can claim to both be innovative and also a cynical gimmick. It pretends to be a musical setting of a poem supposedly written by a child genius and the album came wrapped in a mock-up of a local newspaper featuring on its front page an article about the award-winning junior poet. The rest of the paper is filled with other mock articles, TV listings, small ads etc, all written with a touch of Monty Python type humour. All the Tull albums that preceded this had some songs of merit, but some that were quite forgettable. This plays as one 40 minute song, but is actually a song cycle. It is for me the most consistent Tull album, with each of the songs being very accessible, and not relying too much on Tull's main man Ian Anderson's covering up any absence of lyric with that melodic hiccup in that he does. And it is so English, it predates that very English 90s postmodern irony thing. That thing where you do the thing, but in such a way that you do not commit to it. They called it arch, maybe parody or pastiche, but by not being the thing but a facsimile, it was always beyond criticism. The previous Tull album had been called a concept album, so Ian Anderson wrote this as a parody of the concept album. It works well both as a parody and, ironically, as a concept album. Jethro Tull, Thick as a Brick. <laughs> 